Lamretta. Lamretta is the brand name of mainly motor scooters, initially manufactured in Milan, Italy, by Innocenti. The name is derived from the word Lamrate, the suburb of Milan named after the river which flows through the area, and where the factory was located. Lamretta was the name of a mythical water sprite, associated with the river, which runs adjacent to the former production site. In 1972, the Indian government bought the machinery of the Milanese factory, creating Scooters India Limited, SIL, in order to produce the Lambro three-wheeler, under the name Vikram, for the domestic market. Lamretta Scooters were also manufactured under license by Fenwick in France, NSU in Germany, Servita in Spain, API in India, Yulon in Taiwan, Pasco in Brazil, Autico in Colombia and Siembreta in Argentina. Innocenti SA, also known as Lamretta Consortium, based in Lugano, Switzerland, is the owner of the international trademark Lamretta, and has licensed the brand throughout the world. In 1922, Ferdinando Innocenti of Pescia, built a steel tubing factory in Rome. In 1931, he took the business to Milan, where he built a larger factory, producing seamless steel tubing and employing about 6,000. The factory was heavily bombed and destroyed during World War II. It is said that, when surveying the ruins, Innocenti saw the future of cheap, private transport and decided to produce a motor scooter, competing on cost and weather protection against the ubiquitous motorcycle. The main stimulus for the design style of the Lamretta and Vespa, dates back to pre-World War II Cushman scooters made in Nebraska, United States. These olive green scooters were in Italy in large numbers, ordered originally by the United States military as field transport for the paratroops and marines. The United States military had used them to get around German defense tactics, of destroying roads and bridges in the Dolomites, a section of the Alps, and the Austrian border areas. Aeronautical engineer General Corradino Diascanio, responsible for the design and construction of the first modern helicopter by Augusta, was given the job by Ferdinando Innocenti of designing a simple, robust, and affordable vehicle. It had to be easy to drive for both men and women, be able to carry a passenger and not get its driver's clothes soiled. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Footprints for more videos.